Have you ever wondered how to make the most of solar energy? Imagine a solar panel that automatically follows the sun throughout the day, maximizing energy efficiency. In this video, we will show you how to build your own automatic solar tracking system. So let's get started. For this project, we will need an Arduino Uno board, two LDR sensors, two 220 ohm resistors, one servo motor, one mini solar panel, some jumper wires, a USB cable, a double battery holder, two lithium ion batteries. Let's wear everything up. Take the Arduino and LDR sensors. Connect one leg of each LDR sensor to the GND on the Arduino. Connect the second leg of each LDR in series with the resistor, forming a voltage divider circuit. Connect the same leg of the first LDR sensor to analog pin A0 and second LDR sensor to analog pin A1. Now take the servo motor. The signal pin of the servo motor should be connected to digital pin 11. The servo's VCC goes to the 5V pin on the Arduino and GND goes to the Arduino's GND. Make sure to double check your connection with the circuit diagram. Now download the code and library files given in the description below. Open the code file in the Arduino IDE. First, we include the servo.h library which provides all the functions needed to control the servo motor. This library makes it easy to rotate the servo to a specific angle. Next, we define the pins for the LDR sensors and set an initial position for the servo motor. We also define an error margin to determine when the servo should move. This helps avoid unnecessary movements due to small difference in light intensity. We create a servo object called servo to control the servo motor. In the setup function, we attach the servo motor to pin 11 and set its initial position to 90 degrees. This is a starting point where the panel is aligned. In the loop function, we continuously read the light intensity values from the two LDR sensor using analog read. These values will help determine the direction of the sunlight. We then calculate the difference between the sensor readings. If the difference is within the error margin, the servo doesn't move. But if the difference is significant, the servo adjusts its angle to align with the brighter light source. Finally, we send the new position to the servo motor using the right function and add a short delay to stabilize the movement. And that's it. Now connect the Arduino Uno to your computer using the USB cable for uploading the code. Select port and board in the same menu and select Arduino Uno. Now click on the upload button. Alright, we have completed the wiring and coding. Now mount the solar panel with the servo like this. This servo should be able to tilt the panel horizontally or rotate it as needed. Attach the two LDR sensor on either side of the solar panel. Make sure the sensors face outward. And that's how our project works. As the light source moves, the solar panel adjusts its position, always staying aligned with the strongest light source. This simple yet effective system improves the panel efficiency by tracking the sun throughout the day. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. Thanks for watching our tutorial.